What's up people? This is Zara from Kingdom 200 and in this video we'll talk about some of the new things that this game introduced today. So uh, the basic requirement is that you should have a game version more than 8.10. This will get reflected in your kingdom after the daily maintenance. So once the maintenance is done, uh, you can come here and see that in the hero palace we have two heroes added, uh, mostly these ones. And the game will opt you to select one uh, because the one which you are selecting you will get for free the other one maybe in the future you get uh, recruitment cards to open it second thing uh, the game introduced is the new room of tactics so you can find this in your sage tower and uh, what is this about and what should we focus on we will definitely talk about that in this video first things first we will talk about uh, these two heroes and i have seen a lot of people with the questions which one to select right so uh, before answering that uh, I want to clear something I have unlocked one and we will go with the skills it has if I go to the talent points what I can see here is just attack defense health a lot of DD and lots of DDR some counters and at the end we can see infantry damage and infantry damage reduction so I have unlocked the defending one because I wanted to look at the skills what we have what we are going for and uh, with this I concluded that these are not meant to be used as commanders the reason being in the skill points we have nothing which is commander specific and also in the attributes if you come here all you can see is attack defense and health and the official position of commanders actually requires a lot of thing all of these basic HP offensive damages defensive damages we are not getting anything from here so with this i can conclude that these new heroes are actually meant to attack the castle or defend with right uh, the game also introduced similar heroes uh, like uh, way back four or five months when it introduced these commanders they were not meant to equip on the wall but you can use them for garrison or attacking if you want to have some additional hero uh, to occupy more catapults or something like that so depends on your castle type like i am mostly cavalry archer and siege do not play with infantry much so i can go with either attacking or defending now there is one thing uh, that is very important and very new in this game it's gonna boost your stats a lot and this is the room of tactics so when i open this room i can see that i have nine slots here three in each row so from this I know that I can only have nine books right and I have to unlock those books so how do we unlock is it's actually creating a book so let's say if I click on this right it asks me what book do you want to create what type of book I can select from uh, infantry cavalry archer or siege and uh, I started with cavalry first if I select with the cavalry I can see that this book is going to give me five different type of attributes starting with attack and it goes all the way up to 200 so if I max it out I can get 200 of attack then we have basic defense which goes all the way up to 30 then we have basic attack it also goes all the way up to 30 so those are very big bonuses then we have health uh, the health is 100% then we have this defense it is also 200% Apart from this, we have this middle section here, which tells that it can also increase the damage of your troops and it can also increase the dodge of your troops. And I can see that it can be either worn by hero, it can also be worn by the arrays. Uh, we will also equip them on the heroes and see how do we equip them. And uh, there is also one thing that I noticed which I didn't like, we will also talk about that so in order to unlock that you need this particular thing here which is known as ink so the easiest way to get is that there is a five dollar pack for one ink or you can also get it for free from the royal arena if you go into the royal arena in the arena store you can see that you can buy this ink only once uh, i think it should be one time a day or maybe one time per royal arena i am not sure uh, tomorrow we can get the answers and also we get this tactic fragment 500 of these so you can buy it directly from here if you have the required points if not then it's a five dollar cost so once you unlock it right if you can see i have unlocked this one you can come here and you can upgrade all of these attributes for example uh, for the basic attack i need these tactic fragments again which i get from the royal arena or i can buy a pack here it's like uh, for each hundred you need one dollar 
so for 10,000 there is a hundred dollar pack so once you upgrade it you will have these attributes right it's similar to array uh, in array we have eight positions here we have six and the central one actually it says you can only upgrade it once all of your basic tactic ball reaches level 10 so basically all of these they are known as tactic balls and uh, once all of them are level 10 this gets unlocked and we can upgrade it this is cavalry specific okay so again i created one more cavalry specific there is no change it's not like there is a different one for attack and different one for defense all of these have the same attributes so i created two because i thought one would be equipped by hero and the other one maybe i can equip on arrays so i went ahead and i went to the hero and here i have equipped this the tactic book uh, so there is a new slot uh, next to amulet right so i can keep my amulet existing amulet and i can equip this book i can equip from the both any one of these because i have two right now and you can see it gives me some attributes which i have upgraded like some hp some basic attack we can max them out definitely and you can see that it also increases the damage of my side if i'm equipping it on my hero so i confirm and this is worn by my hero and in my battle reports i can see the attributes now uh, it said that we can also wear them on our arrays and if i go into my array i cannot find anything uh, like my hero like there should be a new slot or the central slot where i can equip them no i cannot do that so what's the deal so in order to understand that see if i come into the royal in right i try to attack someone let's say uh, this guy with a 408 rank right here you can see uh, I can either select my array, let's say I selected the cavalry array, I can attack him normally uh, using my array, or I can either select my book. The one book is worn by the hero, the other one I can use it in place of array, and when I'm using it, I'm getting a dodge. This time not damage, because if you use it on hero, it gives damage. If you use it in the place of array, you get dodge. I can confirm it, and now I am getting the attributes from this book. So uh, this was all about this uh, tactic books and the new heroes. So you can have like all the nine of these books as cavalry if you want. If you are only a cavalry player, you want to equip uh, these books on multiple heroes, right? You can do that or what I'm going to do, I'm an archer defender. So I'm going to create one book for archer and equip it on my archer hero. Then again, I also attack with siege. So even if I keep a combination of two, two cavalry, two archer, two infantry and two siege, I will still be left with one slot which I can use on any extra hero. So I think this was all about this uh, new update. I hope you like the video. If you are new to the channel, subscribe. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. See you in the next video. Till then, have a nice day.